Hey everyone, this is Lucky. Oh, right. Tamal's not with us anymore. That makes me sad. But welcome back to Let's Play Portal 2 Blind. Don't mind the awkward titling because, uh, well, these aren't the extras of the cup mode anymore. Specifically, this is just sort of Portal 2 extras. Like, actually, legitimately, the extras. Right here. Uh, for those of you wonder uh, wondering, just to clarify again, I am not doing the community test chambers because I don't feel like doing them. And because, you know, stuff that's sort of, like, it, it, that's just an endeavor that's just never going to end if I start that, so. Just, like, I, I just want to cover the actual content made by the developers, I guess is what I'm trying to say. And I'm not going to do the challenge mode or developer commentary because I just, I just don't think it's really necessary. So really, all it leaves is the extras and then uh, a closing video after that, and we'll be good to go. Now, I've sort of skimmed through a couple of these, and it seems like a lot of just trailers and stuff, so... Expect me to be quiet for the most part, because I'm just going to kind of let you guys watch these and not sort of interrupt for a lot. And I'll give my thoughts afterwards. So, uh, let's go ahead and get started. With Aperture Laboratories. Cave Johnson here. Every time I look at our test chamber production line, I am reminded of my father. Now, he wasn't a scientist, just a simple farmer. A professor of farming at the local farm college. Never farmed a day in his life. But his theories on farming are the backbone of this company. Do it from scratch. Spare no expense, and never cut corners. Well, that's a corner-cutting machine. We obviously cut them there. Point is, we've always done things the way my father did, and his father before him, and his father before him, and his father before him, and we are almost bankrupt. So, time for a cheaper approach. Allow me to introduce the multiverse. Infinite Earths with an infinite number of apertures. And as of now, they are gonna take over all test chamber construction, and more importantly, all paying for test chamber construction. Why are they agreeing to do that? They're not, we're tricking them. Here's how it works. One, design a test. Two, slip the mole monsters or what have you, the blueprint when they're not looking. Three, once they build it, steal it back. Look at that sad little octopus. <laughs> That's where you come in. We need blueprints. We are about to run the greatest con game in the history of the multiverse and you are the bottleneck. Yes, you. Get back to work. Oh, Cave Johnson, you're always so hilarious. Also, I liked, I, liked, I liked the donut earth. That was pretty cool. And also the useless forklift. And also the squids. Octopuses. Whatever. That was actually... A, um, that's obviously a trailer for the community test chambers, obviously, for, like, you know, the community-made chambers, obviously. So, pretty cool stuff. Meet the bots. It's like, meet the spy or meet the heavy. It's like, just meet the bots. These next tests require cooperation. Consequently, they have never been solved by a human. That's where you come in. You don't know pride. You don't know fear. You don't know anything. You'll be perfect. Chamber completed. Continue testing. Continue testing. Continue testing. The two of you have forged an excellent partnership. Now it's time for your real purpose. Don't disappoint me. Or I'll make you wish you could die. That was such an awesome trailer. Oh man. That was actually really cool. I love how I did show, like, sort of, like, the basic sort of co-op puzzle solutions. I'm glad I didn't show up just because, you know, 
Alright, I'm glad I didn't see this before I did the co-op mode, because it's kind of fun to show those things. They kind of do give, like, a, a lot of, uh, the basic concepts away right there, which, I mean, makes sense for dude for a trailer, but, uh, that was pretty awesome. Also, random person sort of, like, interrupted with their steam. That's kind of funny. Anyway, next trailer. It's been a long time. How have you been? Differences behind us for science, you monster. You monster. So, I guess this is the basic Portal 2 trailer. Pretty cool. Moving on. Ooh, this is another Cave Johnson one. Cave Johnson here. Fact the key to any successful cooperative test is trust. And as our data clearly shows, humans cannot be trusted. The solution? Robots. Then fire the guys who made those robots and build better robots. Then run those robots through a regimen of trust exercises, creating a foundation of mutual respect, reinforced by the simulated bonds of artificial friendship. Inspiring stuff. And finally, we put that trust to the test. Bam! Robots gave us six extra seconds of cooperation. Good job, robots. Gabe Johnson, we're done here. I find it funny that the Tamal robot's the one who pushes the Mii robot in there. Pretty fitting, except it's the exact opposite. Six extra seconds, guys! This looks like another Cave Justin trailer. Let's do it. Cave Johnson here. This is a test chamber. Four walls, ceiling, and a floor. Good enough for science. Not aperture science. Gentlemen, I give you panels. The planks of tomorrow. Fully configurable, infinitely variable, safe. Aperture brand panels will assist your test subjects every step of the way. That is not a panel. That's a crusher. We sell them too. Go oh, crushers. This is actually kind of fun to go through all these. Uh, this is a nice way to just wrap up the project. All right, looks like we have like four more things left. So turrets. It, they, they're always a fun time. Dave Johnson here, introducing the consumer version of our most popular military-grade product. Hi, hello. The turret. How do we get so many bullets in them? Like this. Plus, we fire the whole bullet. That's 65% more bullet per bullet. This is the same technology we've been using on robots for decades. <laughs> Scares the hell out of them. They come in hundreds of designer colors, including forest, Desert, table, uh, evening at the improv. What idiot picked me? Then we box them up and ship them straight to your doorstep. So you can protect the things that matter most. Good night. Just try and get close to that baby. <laughs> your funeral. Gabe Johnson, we're done here. Because that totally seems safe, you know. Let's just put a live turret in our houses. Yes, indeed. All those different turret patterns are pretty hilarious, too. Also, 60% more bullet per bullet. Boots. Hello, investors. Cave Johnson here. Now, I know you've sunk a lot of money into the dual portal device, but I'm here to tell you we're not banging rocks together over here. We know how to make a quantum space hole. Carolyn? See? Portal here, portal there. <laughs> Look at this thing go. Now, we have run into a reproducible human error problem. A lot of expensive equipment getting broken. But don't worry. Cave took care of it. Gentlemen? I give you the long fall boot. Think of it as a foot-faced suit of armor for the portal device. I'm not gonna lie to you, it's expensive as hell. But check this out. We told this test subject to just go ahead and try to land on her head. <laughs> she can't do it. Good work, Boots. So anyway, we're between banks right now. Just make those checks out to cash. Cave Johnson, we're done here.
That's pretty cool how they give an explanation for the boots through a thing like that. Also, Chell's a freaking badass. Holy shit. Anyways, this looks like something different, so... Oh no! Suddenly there's lag! The comic froze my game. It actually froze the game! Well, we're done here. Oh, wait. Oh! It loads... a thing. Which I can only assume is being shown. Interesting. Is this actually... Unable to connect to server. Um... Um... <laughs> I, am, I am not prepared for this. Oh, I went offline. That's why. Well, I'll be right back. So uh, I went downstairs to uh, fix my internet. So <laughs> let's try this again. Now with less, you know, failing at thinking of portals. There we go. Portal 2. Can, this is going to be a little annoying. Just have to scroll down. I like how it's sort of like half drawn though. Anyway, there's apparently 27 of these. Let's do it. Dude, 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 I guess I'll just let you guys read the comic as we go. Actually, I guess I'm going to go into storyteller mode. Why not? Reality is a story the mind tells itself. An artificial structure conjured into being by the calcium ion exchange of a million synaptic firings. A truth so str That is a creepy picture. Can we be I don't care to talk over this thing. And our minds can lie, never doubt it. I'm totally just gonna be reading this and not like actually paying attention to what it means. What's this? Real. Or just my lying mind again. Can't she truly be awake after all this time? No, it's just a figment. If she were real, the turrets were seeing her too. Target acquired. The end is finally upon us. Is that supposed to be like Wheatley? Or a companion cube, or is that the companion cube? I don't know. I don't know what's going on. This is the weirdest freaking thing. Oh, I totally highlighted everything that's dead. Employees only! Do not open for <laughs> the end of times. The companion cube been t What? I, I don't understand. I don't know what this is all about. But you put cameras in the cameras. He'll never suspect. Genius! Get rid of... J oh, so he's like a psychotic person? Okay, you don't need any of those anymore. You're fine. What the hell is this comic? What? What? Another mural to mark the occasion. Hey, that's Chell. What? Who is this guy and what is he? Why is he talking to a cube? Hey, it, no! Go away, person here. That person totally just purposely interrupted my recording. I am. At, that's actually kind of obnoxious. Like, I, like it. No. Don't do that, guys. If you know I'm recording a game, don't interrupt me, please. Anyways. It's cool, though. I don't hate. Uh, stuff. Chell is... <laughs> Who the hell is this guy? <laughs> Let's read comics blind. An explosion. Well, that's interesting. Oh, so this is like the end of Portal 1 then? They hit the kill switch, blah blah blah. All the easy stuff is taken. That's true though. Hmm. So basically, every time they try, to, they try to make artificial consciousness, it tries to kill them. So this is like back in the Cave Johnson days, I guess. What are these pictures? How far are we? We're like 12. We're not even like halfway through it. 
So the, it, it's like after Portal 1. Interesting. Turrets are still alive. Oh, this is how like she got dragged back in. Interesting. <laughs> you right handed or left it. Yeah, you use your left hand just in case, that's funny. Oh, so those like the inhibitor like the inhibitors that they were talking about the way we beat Wheatley back in the end. That's pretty cool. Like, I don't know really much about this comic. I know you guys, there's people in the audience who have, like, a lot more knowledge about, about the Portal lore. So, like, I guess feel free to, like, go in the comments and explain what this comic's really supposed to be all about. Because I'm just sort of, like, showcasing it so that people who haven't done the game can see it, just for the sake of that, I guess. The pills. Soon <laughs> you won't need No, Cube! But, Cube, I love you. Ah, uh, and then, uh... Shell's already putting a long term. Blah blah. And there's turrets blocking the thing. Blah blah. <laughs> that face. <laughs> oh no! I'm not taking this seriously. I'm sorry if I'm ruining this, guys. Cube has gone silent. Must save Cube. Oh, random guy died. Wait. Oh, okay. There we go. Science rhymes with compliance. Hey, that's kind of. You know what does it rhyme with compliance? Neurotoxin. Why can't you love science? Like, insert co-worker's name here. Everyone else is dead. So the guy's schizophrenic, I guess? And he's trying to use his schizophrenia to trick him. Interesting. Your box is broken and it has schizophrenia. That's actually interesting, the whole Schrodinger's cat thing. Yeah, that's true. If you keep poisoning the cat, it's probably going to be dead. Screw reality. Did I actually hit the button? Doesn't look like it. Go! Next page. Oh no. Oh no! We are having issues with the pages again. Hang on a second. Alright, I got the page to load. Let's keep going. <laughs> About that. Of course, the one time I ever have to use the internet while recording, you know, just, just the internet, you know. Blah, blah, blah. Wait. Who? Her? Who? What? Who? What? So he's looking for Shell's file and changing it? That guy has a pretty... Oh, so he's changing the subject test order. Oh, so she goes first and is woken up first or something like that? I don't know. Oh, wait, 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 hang on. Blah, blah, blah. What? Okay, I'm just trying to understand. This guy is still dying. I think it's the same guy. He's like escaped GLaDOS for years or something. Morality core. You like crew of science. Bring your cat to work day. Hmm. That explains the whole Schrodinger thing. 
and that gives her a, a chance to get neurotoxin. Oh, that's a bad idea, scientists. You just screwed yourselves over. Oh, hey, he's alive. The cube is back. But she was the one... The one that... What? Hmm. So I get the feeling this guy's gonna be in Wheatley. That's my guess. We're gonna see. Okay, the cryo unit. So it restarts the life support. So basically he saves Shell's life in between Portal 1 and Portal 2. Oh, and he's like, it's like a stool. So he's the guy who basically saved Shell. Interesting. Ah, so, so he was picked because he has, she has the highest tenacity. Abnormally stubborn, never gives up. So that's, that's Shell for you. Never gives up, never surrenders. It's a very interesting comic, sort of a little feeling between Portal 1 and Portal 2 and what happened. I kind of like it. That's actually pretty cool. Well played. Well played, developers. Anyway, back to this for the one last thing we have to do, which is Super 8 Interactive Teaser. Now, this is weird, because I, I sort of looked at this for a second. It's like you you play the trailer. It, it's kind of weird, so we're going to give this thing a try and see what happens. And uh, apologies for the random shenaniganry but that happened there, but uh, what do you expect when the internet just decides, hey, hey you, piss off you. Good job, Internet. I love you. I love you so much. This is, this is just a really weird episode. It's a very kind of la laid-back extras sort of video. Like, I didn't really know what I wanted to do to cover this, this stuff, but I felt, why not, you know? More stuff. I always like having extra videos. It's, it's kind of fun. So we actually get to play, like, the trailer. So I guess we do get to end the game by actually playing something, which is cool. So we're here in, like, some create. It's really cool that they did this. I think this is really cool. Yeah, yeah, I know you can zoom. Blah blah blah. We've played the game before. I want this. I want the file. I want the. I want the mug. Give me the mug. Give me the mug. I want the mug. Give me the mug. Give me the mug. Give me the. Darn it. Anyway, so I guess we assumedly, we're, we're. I don't know anything about Super 8, so don't expect me to know what the heck I'm doing. Basically, whoa. That's not creepy. That wasn't creepy. That actually cut this. 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 Imagine if they made like a horror game using the this like the Portal 2 engine. That'd be creepy ass shit, dude. Wait, I'm going the wrong way. Let's go the right way. I'm assuming I have to go through this door. Door? Yes? No? Is there something I'm actually... Holy shit! Okay! Was not expecting that. That was scary. Yeah, like I said, they could do some crazy shit if they wanted to. Well, that was a way to end the game. I'm, I'm, is that the end for the trailer? Because that wasn't really a trailer. That was just like, hey, we're on a train. Hey, things exploded. Oh, no, nope, no, nope, we're okay. We lived. We survived death. Well, that that's awfully good. Fine and dandy. Do I get to play again? I do get, I do get to play again. So, uh, will we not have random explosions and stuff scaring the crap out of me? Now I'm all like semi freaked out here thanks game appreciate it real nice of you like I said I don't know anything about Super 8 at all I never saw I never really looked into it in the slightest I'm not the biggest movie buff things are just breaking all over the shit here that was that was a, fr a fr ow Did that just hit me Did I just take damage can I die in the trailer? Can I fail the trailer? That'd be kind of hilarious. Where am I going? Actually, where am I actually? Oh my god! I exploded! I, I can't move. Oh, well that's not good. I would explain why I can't move. Oh, and there's a thing in the train car. Hello to you too, sir. Well, that was just weird. Oh, and then it loads you to like the official movie site because you know I totally no, I don't, I don't care. 
I don't care. This isn't about super... Hey, I got 52% of the achievements. Only 52%, but I imagine a lot of them have to do with, like, other sort of stuff, so, uh... Yay for me! But that's it for the extras, so that's it for Portal 2. So, guys, um, there is one more thing I'm going to take care of, but that'll be in the beginning of the closing video, and uh, that'll be the point where I give the final thoughts. I'm not going to bother giving any final thoughts here, uh... So this is Lucky70X, stay tuned next time for the uh, fail montage slash closing video, you know, my usual thing. And uh, that'll be coming next time. So this is Lucky70X, signing out. Bye-bye, guys.